<laughs> when you spend so long doing a nose contour and then you put your lenses in, your eyes go all watery and your nose runs and then you wipe off your contour. Anyway, hi. As the title says, I'm going to show my bag collection. I don't even know if I can fit all the bags in the video because I have a lot. I'll start with this one. <laughs> I don't know what to begin with. Um, first up is my Skinny Dip Silver Holographic bag. I actually got this for free because my friend used to work for Skinny Dip and she was like, yo, do you want a bag? And I said, oh, hell yeah. Um, you can tell I use it a lot. It's got all like, you know, it's got a lot of signs of wear. I used to take it to work every day. Here's another holographic bag I got for my birthday. It's from Primark, but it looks good. And it's just, it's really shiny. <clears throat> it's quite sturdy as well for Primark. I needed a red bag for so long. And I literally, it was just always the wrong red. So I had to cave. And I ended up getting this, I think it's by Loris. I got it on eBay, I'm sure it's a Loris bag. I have a lot of heart bags. And here's another one. I won this. Uh, this is by, I don't know how to say the brand. Puvithel? 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 Correct me if I'm wrong. Um, this is a handmade bag and I won it at the Minori meet and greet tea party thing I'm a jiggy and it's got red with uh, black <laughs> with dark green leaves and it's very slithering this is originally by dreamy bows but I got it second hand for like eight pound whoop, whoop. and it's just just standard pink lolita bag my friend Sarah made me this adorable tote bag with Christmas cats. It's by um, George at Asda. It's actually a duvet and she made me and my friend Michelle the matching tote bags. And this is PVC, glitter PVC, and inside is all confetti. So if you can see it at the bottom there, and then you can tip it up and it moves around. It's just, I got so many compliments. I used this yesterday uh, when I went shopping and everybody was like, girl, where they from? So if you would like to request a cute tote bag, her shop is Plastic and Bows, and you can find them on Instagram too. As most of you know, I'm a huge Harry Potter nerd. So I got me a Hogwarts um, satchel bag, and it's like a little school bag, and it literally looks like something that you would take to school. If you went to school in Hogwarts, which I wish I did. That was by Primark. This is by Floozy, and you will see after this video, I love Floozy bags. I don't know how many I own. And the inside always has this print. Um, the only thing I don't like about this bag is it doesn't have a zip. Um, and I go to London a lot and I get really scared about pickpockets, but it's quite like they'd have to proper like lean in and be like, I'm gonna take your shit. But I have a little Sailor Moon. Thing. I'm not actually a fan of Sailor Moon. I tried. I tried to watch it and get into it, but I think it's one of those shows that unless you watch it when you're a kid, it's quite hard to get into, you know, at the age of 24. I forgot how old I was for a second. I was like, am I 24 or 25? I'm 24. Will be 25. Um, but I just really like this heart. It's like literally the only Sailor Moon thing I own. Because I don't want to buy things that I'm not a fan of. Like, yeah, aesthetically it looks nice, but I don't want to be a faker, you know. I don't want to be like, yo, Sailor Moon everything. I don't even watch the show. This is another heart bag in kind of like a... looks kind of like a fleshy tone nude pink with a bow. And this, I think, is originally by Dream V or Yumit on Yumitembo. Um, there's actually a gift... From one of the parents at the nursery I used to work out and that's so nice like that's such a lovely gift like she actually looked on my Facebook like because we're, we're friends on Facebook um, and she knew like what my style was and the things I actually liked and I just I thought it was really nice for her I have this the S is it Esther or Esther Esther that bunny uh, rucksack 
and I'm sorry, but this is a replica. I found it on eBay before I even saw the, uh, is it by Wago? Well, no, it's WC in it. Before I even knew that it was by them. So I was like, wow, that bunny's so cute. And I, I knew it was like a ripoff of Esther Loves You, but yeah. And then I saw the bunny bags. I was like, oh, shit. So like you can kind of tell because it's not as like fluffy and you have to stuff it with something to make him all fat and cute. But oh well, I got him now. I found him on eBay and they do like three different colours. They do lavender, white and pink. But because I was so torn, I ended up getting the handbag version. And it comes with a pearl strap, not a chain strap, even though this is just as annoying because it rolls off your shoulder and you can't adjust it. So, But it looks a lot nicer than chain straps. Yeah, it's quite small inside, but it's more for like, because it looks nice. I'm, I wouldn't, I would like use that and then have another handbag with me. Um, my next bag is by Collective. They did this in pink as well. Most people were really surprised I didn't buy the pink, but... I needed a red bag. Only thing I dislike is the chain strap. But the actual bag itself is beautiful. And I got it on sale for like, I think £21. This is my holographic seashell bag, which is from eBay. I think it was supposed to be like a rip off of Skinny Dip, but I think they did a silver one. Um, but I needed a pink one to go with my this mermaid themed outfit that kind of never really happened but I've used it quite a few times but I love that it's like it's got pearls and then it's got the strap as well it's just a nice little touch I've stuck that on I don't know why um, I don't really keep many key rings on my bags because I like them displayed here and then I just take what I need depending on my outfit this is my ginormous nude pink bluesy bag little frillies, little love heart, it's got little love heart details here um, and the inside has the floozy pattern as well and they're just like floozy bags are so sturdy, they last me ages like look at the little frilly, frilly detail along the edge I just think it, they're really nice bags and this is good for like I usually stay over in London a lot with friends so I can fit like a day's worth of clothes and makeup in here and it looks nice. Excuse me because this one is very well loved and I took it to Japan so it's a bit grubby looking but this is my <laughs> my like plush My Melody bag. I got it second hand oh, on Facebook. Um, I love this bag but I hate that the material is like suede because when this gets wet, suede stinks really bad and it's like, well this doesn't smell. But you know, like you can look at the material and imagine that getting all wet and it's all fluffy, it's like don't ruin my bag. This beauty is from eBay and I think it was only like £25, it was just a random listing and I was like, <gasps> get that because I find with Sanrio bags they're on there for like a few days and then they're just gone you can never find them again so it has this print I don't know, even know who it's by I don't know if it's a replica but girl and I have my keyring from Japan this is another floozy bag again like look at the detailing the little frills i use this bag a lot it's just decent size got a shoulder strap as well the inside has the floozy pattern and as you can see floozy. um i have a bit weeby it doesn't really go with the bag but <laughs> i've got an l key ring and an aristocats key ring oh my god that i got in paris but one of the cats fell off i've had this think for like three years and it's still in good condition this bag you can tell I've used a lot so this is by Spree Picky I think it's originally by Loris yeah it says inside Loris um the purple was like all scratching off of here so I put ribbon around it and I did put a bow but that bow fell off so I've just got one on there at the moment um but like you can see on the handles like no why is it gonna happen but um, yeah, I didn't have any purple bags. Standard heart shaped one is always good. 
Here's another floozy bag. I love me some hot pink. Um, just a fluffy pom pom from eBay. Some little tassels and love hearts. A shoulder strap as well. Bow floozy and decent size. Um, all floozy bags are from Debenhams, by the way. And I used to work in Debenhams, so I used to get discounts on my floozy bags. I'm not really a rucksack kind of gal because I don't like not being able to see my bag and I I nearly got pickpocketed once um, and I was wearing a rucksack and the man like I could feel him opening my bag and like nearly went to reach in and I turned around um, yeah and ever since then I was like oh my god but sometimes you need to use a rucksack when you're like staying over at people's and you've got a lot of stuff so I kind of always have like a small handbag in front of me with like my phone and my purse and everything else will just be closed so if they're gonna nick anything you're gonna be nicking my socks or my underpants so well maybe they like that there's some people that like to give them a little sniff you never know I got this rucksack a very very long time ago at like MCM back in I don't know I think I was still in university when I bought it um, and it's got little macaroons and donuts and all that good stuff the straps are a bit annoying they're kind of like seat belts and you put them to the length that you want and then they just sort of move around themselves it's not too bad um, it's lasted a while and it's just a really really nice print in it this is another rucksack cheap one from ebay um it's kind of already falling apart i might need to buy another one i kind of want the blue one um because i don't really like this bow it's a bit ugh. i prefer like a pvc bow um but it's huge and you can fit so much in here it's really deep and wide that was she said and yeah yeah i think it's only like 12 pound quite good and I liked it so much that I got the smaller version in hot pink and this bow is better look at that this is actually a key holder but my key is too fat so I just use it on there um yeah and the brand is like cry oh cool baby cool baby you are cool baby oh my nose yeah <sighs> um then I got this yellow star bag second hand I was after a yellow bag for a long time and I finally came across one and it's by Loris um, it's quite awkward to open and undo because of the shape but it's really cute I can't really fit much in it but oh well it'll just teach me to pack lighter won't it sorry it's been a bit squashed but it's another bluesy bag with cherries and polka dots and little love hearts there um, and it also came with a shoulder strap. I feel like it's very retro, like quite, you could do like a good 1950s rockabilly cord with this. This is probably a replica, who knows, I found it on eBay. I needed a biscuit bag and I found one for like £12 and it's probably, I think it's like a swimmer replica. It did have a shoulder strap but this bit, like it broke. Because that's what you get for eBay, and that's what you get when you buy in China. So, and it comes with a little spoon and a fork. But yeah, it's cute. This is also a replica of Lost Mannequin, um, the Angel Wing rucksacks. Um, but it's actually lasted so well. It's actually from Taobao. Sorry, it's it's really awkward shape to show because obviously it's got nothing inside it. Um, it's like draw next up this is a replica bag um it's by lost mannequin um can't really see like the shape because there's nothing in it but it opens up and it's a drawstring bag and it's actually really huge like, i fit loads in here and then it's got pockets here there and there um kind of wish i got the all pink one but back when i bought this i was still a bit like edgy emo so <laughs> I got the black one um but yeah it's it's actually a really good bag like it's from Taobao and it's a replica and it's lasted like I think I bought it um when I was about 18 next is my 
bare plushy like fluffy lavender bag and it's got a little pom-pom and I think this is by Spins and this bag's really good because you can put like because it's quite plain but you can put loads of badges all over it and decorate it how you like now I'm moving on to like my smaller clutch bags this is one of my favourites it's a perfume bottle bag which I've got at MCM I don't know the brand it's got two I don't know why it opens up this side and that side and it's got a little thing which is it's quite a good idea but it's so tight like you can barely get your fingers in it that's what she said but I really like perfume bottle stuff so this is like 20 quid I have another perfume bag which is I think it's from Next my friend got me it for my birthday and it pops open only thing is it's got a chain again but it's really cute it goes with a lot of stuff and it's very sturdy I found this in Nuke? nope Primark I think it was on sale for a pound and it's pink and metallic and frilly and it's quite huge so I was like yes this is a clutch bag by my friend Roxy Sweetheart and it's, he's got a little holographic bow this print is called Poochie and it's very like 80s spank inspired with a holographic back um, and inside of course is pink and it says Roxy Sweetheart and it's really cute look at him this is my hot pink like PVC uh, clutch bag with a love heart and it's actually hollow so you can be like Woo! I don't know why you would do <laughs> I would do that if I was drunk I take it out clubbing um, it's actually from Basel and Market cheap, cheerful like tacky and a bit chavvy that's Basel and Market for you and I got this fluffy feathery clutch bag from Primark and I had the exact same one in this peachy nudie pink kind of colour and last bag we're getting there. I got this beautiful, fluffy clutch bag by Miss Selfridge and I got it in sale. They had it in purple as well, but for some reason I bought the blue many years ago. Um, I don't really wear much blue, but it's just so beautiful. Ta da! There's all my bags. Um, I also have shopping bags here. Um, some like a regular toy for Nangela Pretty and Shizzle because in the UK you have to pay 5p for plastic bags I used to like reuse like Asda bags and Shizzle but I thought why do that when you could use cute bags I hope you liked please subscribe and I shall see you whenever I next make a video <laughs> bye